Hey there, Scorpio, and welcome to your reading. Guys, this is going to be a reading for Scorpio. Now, in your meditation, Scorpio, I got Deuteronomy, uh, chapter 20, and it's, uh, I want you to read 19 and 20, but i uh, read it all, but I'm going to read you the second two um, scriptures. It says, in case you lay sledge to a city many days by fighting against it so as to capture it, you must not ruin its trees by wielding, or wielding as an axe against them, for you should eat from them. You must not cut them down. For is the tree of the field a man to be desledged by you? Be sledged by you. Only a tree, and here goes to one. Only a tree that you know is not a tree for food. It is the one you should ruin. And you must cut it down and build sledge works against the city that is making war with you until it falls. Okay. Let's get on to the Leman, Leah Norman. Alright guys. You are. Uh, there may be a friend that you uh, consider a, a lifelong friend. Um, a soulmate type of energy that uh, this is definitely female um, someone uh, has taken ill um, this friendship has had uh, some changes with it um, there were some struggles that have taken place and um, this is a type of nervous energy that there are some conversations that you and this individual may have had that struck some, you know, some nerve, some chords. And uh, it may have severed your friendship um, with whoever this person is that's, that's coming in. Um, I feel that uh, this was uh, some type of difficult negotiations that um intervened in you to you your relationship with each other uh let's get some more on this for my scorpio so at one point you you actually considered this person a soulmate someone who that you consider family. But there, there, like, there were some negotiations uh, tore you to a point. This person may be fallen ill at this time and you know that's what happens. So ones uh, yeah, you weren't having this person's um, actions towards you, uh, and it led you to make a head over uh, a wise choice, a, a decision rather quickly uh, regarding your uh, stability, your your environment with the Ten of Pentacles here. Yeah, the uh, King of Wands with the Four Cups. And the Knight of Swords with the uh, Ten of Pentacles. Uh, I see that you may have had to make some, do, uh, create some action regarding so, so, some situations that, you know, it's just like, look, I'm just, see that? I'm not accepting your offer of whatever, you know, whatever you, they were dishing on you and you were like, oh, uh-uh. I'm mentally, I'm, I'm, I'm in search of creating 
You know, it's just like being in charge. See, charge mode. Look. Oh, no, you're not taking my foundation. My, uh, this is what you create, not only your love, right, but your environment, your happy home. This can have something to do with that. Which completed a cycle with the world. And it has left you um, in other in a state of, uh, you know, this is immaturity. This is being seen uh, as being creating problems. Okay, definitely, it's visibly seen. So everyone knows about it now. A death is coming. This could be a physical death, with illness, and that's why this person's reaching out. This is a message of problems that a cycle is completing. Okay, so they may have been getting over their past, uh, their past hurts, and saying, you know, look, I'm sick, I'm, you know, something like that, and I like to to clear things up with you. You know, because something's about to change drastically. Could possibly be a death. This um, seems like a very, uh, another almost personal reading. Oh my goodness, transformation is coming for wish fulfilled. Now, that's exactly what I was saying. The love that was missing, see? is a wish fulfillment for this person. The transformation taking place where a cycle was closed and problems were 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 on the the forefront is transforming into happiness now, a wish fulfilled for you. Devil, Hermit, Ace of Swords. So I see, no matter what, there was something uh, that you were um, passionately involved in, okay? Whether it be your environment, right? That you were going to go in search of the healing a clarity needed. This is like this is mine. You're not coming in to take it. I'm gonna go and fulfill. I'll go and search of my wish fulfillment, my happiness with the sword of truth. This is clarity needed straight from God. So you came in with the truth with this person and said, you know, I was very passionate about this because this was mine. And that, I had to go in search of ways to show you or show this person that you're dealing with, Scorpio, that the truth stands. See? The truth will be shine right through so taking a new initiative making that logical decision to stand alone you had to stand in your own power you this person does it for themselves okay this is the very independent the lines or a single energy. Let me see what else you want to say. So you had to have the strength to say, look, this is where my passion lies. And I have to have the strength and 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 with the knight of wands here 
to charge in with my actions and then I'm going to give you communication about it. This is how it went down. This is why I did what I did. And if this has everything to do with your environment, your homestead, honey, you there was no backing down. You know, someone is going to stand up for what they believe to be true. And I think that when you came in with the truth and you offered, said, look, I'm coming in to offer you this, but um, I'm sorry, I had to stand alone on the decision. See the decision? You had to make that decision to stand alone. So you could have had to say, look, you know, I need to stand up for myself in what I regard to be mine and true. And here's the proof. When you offered this person truth, it, it was almost like, I just have to do this all by myself. You know, bottom of the deck, the emperor. You had to be aggressive. He is the masculine energy that you come from, you embody. Okay, the action oriented is what I see coming. You know, this is the Aries energy. He is the masculine Um, person with the drive, sorry, hit the microphone again, with the drive needed to embody all the kings to, to do this. Wow. And take a leap of faith to, to remove the bandages. Oh my goodness. So you are stuck in a, in a way in this. You had to, to be aggressive because this person you had to take that new leap of faith to take the, the bandages off. It was like you know when somebody puts you in a corner and you come out swinging, you know, no, you're not going to do this to me. I know what's true to be mine and I'm going to stand behind it. And it's almost like, uh, you know, with the King of Swords and the Ace of Swords, you had every, every right in your mind. You, you knew what was true. And what was authentic. And you were going to stand behind your actions. Good deal. But you know guys. Um, Scorpios. I was raised by Scorpio. And, uh, yeah. If she knew what was uh, to be true. was no backing down and she stood behind you know that's a water sign they stand behind their emotions so I can see Whew. that was a difficult one especially with a Scorpio like this it's like oh 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 I see where that Aries Emperor come in Anything else you'd like to tell Scorpio? We'll start. We'll stop right here. Look at the bigger picture. So whatever um, this person, um, I do believe. Let me see. 
a new start's coming. That's what I was about to say. I do believe this person wants to make amends with you because something's going on with them. Your hard work is paying off. So I do think that they're starting to see the bigger picture of where you were coming from. Okay, that you're behind truth behind your actions is definitely standing out at this point. Prosperity lies ahead. So I see this as y'all are moving on. That's great, guys, you know. Um, there's nothing like a fresh start. That's what I just heard. There's nothing like a fresh start. Guys, if this reading resonates with you, please give me a thumbs up. And I will continue... Uh, my personal readings uh, that I know have been piling up. Um, please have some patience with me after I get through my zodiac readings. That's when I'll start those. Um, besides, if you look at my subscriber account, I have uh, given away the person who uh, subscribed the 1,000 subscriber. So, I'll get your reading up soon, guys, with that. I bid you namaste.